Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, everybody. Thank you and welcome to my page today. And as always, uh, this is interview day where I choose somebody from our community of business owners and uh, have a little chat to them about, you know, some of the common things that we like to ask. So I'm going to uh, ask this lovely lady today. Her name is Limpo and she's coming from Zambia in Southern Africa. How cool is that? All the way from Africa. And I'm in Newfoundland, Canada, and we're talking with each other. It never ceases to amaze yeah. me that I can connect with people from anywhere in the world and we can talk about our digital business. So welcome to my page, Limpo. It's very nice to have you today. Could I just ask you to introduce yourself? Tell us a little bit more about you, who you are, what you work at, and that, that sort of thing. Okay, thanks a lot, Kim. Thank you. Uh, can I call you Kim, by the way? Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. I'm so honored to be on your page today. And uh, thank you for inviting me. You're welcome. My name is uh, Lim Limpom Londa Mangala. I'm a wife. I'm a mother. I'm a grandmother. Wow. I am an accountant. <laughs> yeah, I'm a grandmother. <laughs> you don't like <laughs> it. <laughs> I am an accountant. Actually, I'm still, though I'm an accountant, I'm still studying. Oh, okay. Studying, actually. I'm, I'm doing uh, ACCA. Okay. I hope uh, you know about it. It's an association of certified uh, accountants. Yeah. Right. And then that aside, I am a digital entrepreneur. Wow. Yeah. That's you, about me. I'm also better. a Christian, actually. Oh, awesome. Me too. We, yeah, wonderful. You are a busy woman. I am. I tell you, I am. <laughs> okay, so I won't keep you too long. So you mentioned you're a digital entrepreneur. So why would you start a digital business after all of that stuff you named out to me that you're involved with? You're a mom and a wife and you're studying and you're working as an accountant. Good grief, you've got your plate full already. Why start a business? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Actually, um, besides uh, digital entrepreneurship, We've also been doing these other small, small businesses. Okay. But we were not breaking even. Huh? We were not breaking even. Each time it was, it was always uh, challenges to get through. So in our quest, we were not looking for a digital entrepreneurship uh, business, no. But uh, in our quest to better ourselves, we kept on looking for better ways to run the businesses that we were running. Okay. And uh, we came across, we came across this business. And the reason for doing it, we saw, like I've mentioned, I'm a mom and a grandmother. So we have a family, a large family. All those people, my husband is a retired magistrate. Okay. When we were having, when we were having, when my husband was working, Things were easy because we were having two salaries. That's right. And you know, magistrates, they earn a lot of money. So things were much, much, much better, but we were still not breaking even. Okay. Yeah. We have uh, four of our children in private universities. Oh. And we have two of our children in boarding schools. And the other little ones are in kindergarten. And so it's not easy. So this business came up, we came across it. And uh, our reason really was for the family. We want to provide for our children and our grandchildren. We want to give them the very best that life has to offer. Kim, having so many children and in private universities is not easy. I can only Having imagine. grandchildren, yeah, it's not easy. So really that's how come this business, when we came across it, we embraced it, we came in fully. We didn't even hesitate. I didn't hesitate. I saw this is the business that will actually 
bring more meaning to my life and the life of my children and everybody that I love. Amazing. Yeah. And you can imagine, Kim, having all those children who were not able to, we can't, we can't go to, on vacation. We no. can't. We would not be able to, because we have got children who are in private universities and, and all these other kind of schools. So meaning that month in, month out, we were not breaking, we were just surviving. Yes. And uh, life was really unbearable. But when this opportunity came, wow, we are able slowly <laughs> to make things happen. Yeah. So the reason for doing this business is because of our family. We want to provide for them. We want the very best for our children. And we want to spend quality time with them. Wow, yeah. that's so true. So true. So how many children do you have? <laughs> a lot. A lot. It sounds like a lot. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. <sighs> I have a lot of children, a lot. I wouldn't okay. uh, mention the number, but but they're more than five. More than five. <laughs> okay. That's oh, good. Yes. Wow. Some some adopted. Some adopted. Okay. You are blessed indeed. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So what would you say is the most important thing you've learned since becoming a business owner? How long have you been in business, in the digital business? For the past uh, 14 months. 14 months. Okay. For the past 14 months. Okay. So yeah. what would you say is so the, the most the, important thing? The most important thing that I have learned yeah. is that... There is self-discovery. You discover yourself, Kim, when you yes. come in this business. Absolutely. The things that uh, I, I, I in, in the past, before becoming a digital entrepreneur, there was a way in which I was looking at life. And with all those challenges that I talked about, you would find that sometimes when we are so hard pressed, we'll call back, we'll coil in our shells and start whining this, whining that. <laughs> but with this business, We've discovered ourselves and we look at life in a certain perspective. Even when things sometimes are not, uh, we're not able to do certain things, maybe to satisfy some need, we know tomorrow is coming. We'll be able to satisfy that need. It's not like before. So there's that self-discovery. There's that personal development that I've discovered in this business. And Kim, I can tell you I'm more than the way I was before. Wow. I am so confident now. I'm so confident and I love this business and what it's doing to my family. Wow. Yeah. It, is, um, it is definitely something that will give you confidence. I can certainly vote for that one. And uh, you do. Yeah. There is a lot of personal development that happens. Even if you don't even believe it does, when you look back, it is amazing to see where you were and where you are now. So I yeah. certainly agree with that yeah. one for sure. So what would yeah. you say will yeah. be your favorite part of being a big digital business owner? Wow, the favorite thing that I love is I get to meet people like you, Kim. People who <laughs> are so you. loving, <laughs> people who are so supportive, people who are so embracing. Kim, uh, if without this business, I would not have known you. I know, it's crazy. I would not have known you. And the other thing, you know, there are a lot of things about this business. I love the flexibility as well. Oh. It's so flexible. I can do it at my own time. Yes. I love the community because you get to meet all lots of people. You know, here it is now I have Kim in Newfoundland. That's right. And the flexibility. And just everything about uh, this business that is making me more confident, more uh, personally developed than the way I was before. That's right. Yeah. And that just spills over into every aspect of life. Being confident makes you a yeah. better mom and a better wife and a better worker. Yeah. You're just everything. Exactly. Just everything. That's exactly. Right. Exactly. That's right. It's hard yeah. to choose just one favorite part. I know I have the same thought. And again, my favorite part yeah. is being able to talk to people from all over the globe. I mean, where else would exactly. I ever meet Limpo? I would never cross your path. 
And no, here we are today no. chatting like we're old friends. I love it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, somebody was telling me today, uh, somebody was, a workmate was telling me today, the workmate that had gone with where I was working, he was saying, you are always smiling. What is it? It's like you are always receiving good news. But isn't it good news every day? <laughs> uh, but, you know, let's share some of these things. I said, but what should we share? The fact that you are alive is good news itself. So I couldn't explain fully why. But he was telling me, you are now you are always smiling. That's what this business can do because every day you'll be smiling. You, right. Every day it will bring, it will bring uh, happiness, you know? It will bring happiness. Even when things are rough, I, I'm, I'm not saying that when you become a digital entrepreneur, suddenly, you know, things, maybe it becomes like magic and overnight success. And No, it's not like that. No. It, Persistence, perseverance, then you are you you are you are okay. You are you are good to go. And with uh, what this business does, it will mold you in a certain way that uh, that persistence, that perseverance, gives you so much joy. It gives you so much happiness. Absolutely. It gives you so much confidence. And when you look at the community and you look at all these wonderful people and their stories. You are just so overjoyed with everything else. Yeah. Couldn't agree more. I couldn't agree more. Okay. So I don't want to take yeah. up too much of your time today because I know you're super busy. Um, but my last and final question would be, what would you say to all of the viewers out there that are watching this recording today and they are still sitting on the fence after everything that we've said, what would you say to them in a, the last few words you, you can share? What I can tell to people who are still skeptical, they are still doubting, they are still wondering what this all about is that go to Kim <laughs> on her on her business page. Look at what she's doing. Watch, register and watch the webinar. Absolutely. Then you understand we are not just making these stories. This is the truth. And I'm a living testimony of what this business is doing. So all of you people who are wondering and thinking, what is this all about? No, these people, they're just making up stories. What I would encourage you, the proof is in the pudding. Unless you test, you will never know how good it is. Unless you test, you will never know whether it's appealing to you. The first thing I'm talking about is to you, for you to register and watch our complimentary webinar. There is a complimentary webinar and all you need to do is just register and watch. And then you watch, you understand what you're talking about because when you watch, there are testimonials from real people, industry leaders who be saying what I'm saying now That's and true. even much more of what this business has done for, for them. So come and see, yeah. Come and see. Final last words, watch the webinar, just check it out and come and see. Wow. Well, thank you yeah. so much, Limpo, for agreeing to meet with me and have a chat today. It has been an absolute joy to chat with you and to get to know you. And here we are, friends, where else could you do this? Thank you so, so much yeah. for being uh, my I'm guest so today. I'm so honored, Kim. I'm so honored. Thanks so much. Thank you so much. Alrighty. Yeah. You have an awesome day. And my prayer is that you will be blessed. Your many, many blessings on your family and your business as you continue forward. So thank you so much. And you thank have a great you. day. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank okay. you. Thank you.